sponsored by Baugh Auto Body. Welcome back. We're continuing to keep you ahead of the storm as we do have a severe thunderstorm warning for locations in Amelia, Chesterfield, the city of Richmond, Cumberland, Goochland, Henrico, as well as Powhatan. This storm is moving to the east at 35 miles per hour. You obviously can tell there is a lot of lightning associated with this system. And of course, within the system, we are dealing with winds gusting at around 60 miles per hour. We've had many reports of golf ball size hail. This was earlier on just over into Dillwyn, but we are getting reports of that as well as into Cumberland because that hell core is beginning to uh, beginning to rebuild. Now, right now, this is a live photo that we're taking. Of course, this is a trained storm spotter. We are taking incredible precautions. This is a live over into whole street and we're going to be getting closer to the situation as well. People slow down. Make sure your wipers are on. Like Kristen said, this is not the time to be driving with that cruise control. But right now, let's take a look. Here is our severe thunderstorm warning. As far as the situation is concerned, a large hell core. I mean, look at this hell core currently. When you see the reds, you know we are dealing with quite a bit of heavy amount of hell. It's got to come down at some point. This is what is still up in the clouds. Amelia, you'll probably see some pea sized hell, but of course, as this continues to Stay along with us. Mosley, you could be dealing with large pieces of hell in your direction very shortly. Now, when it comes to the reflectivity, what we're seeing when it comes to our velocity, we do have a little bit of rotation associated with this storm. Currently, it is a severe thunderstorm warning. We do not have any indication of a tornadic activity, but we are dealing with quite a bit of high winds associated. And you can tell we do have a little bit of a not notch beginning to form around into Amelia. So Amelia, you're probably having some high wind speeds. You may be seeing some of those funky clouds in your vicinity. Right now we're dealing with that severe thunderstorm warning. Make sure you are getting down to the lowest portion of your house in case this does continue to mature. We want to make sure you are staying safe. This all this lightning associated, we're going to probably be dealing with some people losing power. I know we've already been with those power outages. That is not fun. But look at all this. 298 strikes with this system right now. That is a lot of lightning and this is cloud to ground lightning associated with it that is going to continue to edge its way. So let me put this in motion for you so you can get a view. It is moving to the east at 35 miles per hour. And as far as the timing is concerned, let's map it out for you. Let me zoom out a little bit so you can get a better perspective of your location. And of course, we do have other storms with us as well. But here's what we are seeing with this severe thunderstorm warning that is currently going to be pushing into the metro shortly. It is moving at 35 miles per hour and we are looking at to impact right around Midlothian at 653, Tuckahoe 703, the city of Richmond 711, Verina 722. And you can tell from this live picture that we're looking at, this is over on Hull Street, not seeing too much in the way of heavy rain just yet because they are on the outskirts of the system. And of course, once they do get closer, you will be dealing with some higher winds as well as heavier amounts of rain. So here's what we are seeing right now in the central locations, Richmond, very light rain. You are getting some thunder as well well as a lot of lightning associated, but all of this will continue to edge its way to the east at 35 miles per hour. We are seeing some pea sized hail associated with the other storms, but we do not have a warning on crew, just some heavy amounts of rainfall along with a lot of lightning. That lightning, of course, will strike outside of any given thunderstorm around 15 to even 25 miles. So when you hear that thunder roar, I know it's so cliche, but go indoors. That's what you want to do is to stay safe. That storm and crew is going to head towards Wilson here in just a few minutes. And look at all this. Oh my goodness, Spotsylvania. You are covered up with that heavy amount of rainfall. You're not seeing anything in the way of severe weather, but of course, you don't have to have a severe warning to actually be dealing with damaging conditions. We do have high winds associated with you, along with a lot of lightning, continue to edge into Port Royal. As far as the storm, once again, this is continuing to edge to the east, 35 miles per hour, a lot of lightning associated. This is cloud to ground lightning. We've got golf ball size hell with this system. We do have a severe thunderstorm warning that is going to continue to edge to the east at 35 miles per hour. Here is the trail for you. Of course, that's a severe thunderstorm warning for Amelia, Chesterfield, the city of Richmond, Goochland, Henrico, Powhatan, looking to intersect right around the Richmond at 7.06. That is sped up just a little bit. Hopeful at 7.26. We'll continue to keep you safe, but guys, this is a storm that you really want to be cautious with, especially if you're out on those roadways, because we will be dealing with low visibility in just a minute. Yeah, thanks, Nikki D. Great work there on that update. We did see just how slick it was right. on that live shot from Eric in the corner. And just the timing of this, Kristen, with morning rush hour. Exactly. So yeah. you can expect to see a lot of brake lights out there, folks. And take a look behind me. This is the Shaco Valley Bridge, 64 West. And we're already seeing that thick traffic already coming together, all due to congestion. So 64 West trying to make that merge onto 95 North or